Hey, I'm back. And today I want to show you something that I saw recently that I thought would be interesting. And it's this. So hopefully you can see here, these are Wagyu potato chips. Or I don't know if these are potato chips or even corn chips, but I saw these at my local store and I was like, what, what are these? And I don't know. For those that don't know, Wagyu is just a name for like Japanese beef. It's Japanese high quality beef. So some of you might know this as a Kobe beef, but there's actually other types that are also good. Like I was it Matsuzaka beef, but uh, this is supposedly that flavor on potato chips, which I don't really understand how they did that, but you can see it here. Um, it has, it's like a potato chip and it's supposed to be this type of beef. So for those that may aren't familiar, the difference is it has a lots of fat and it's not just, you know, chunks of fat on it. It's like inside the uh, meat, it's mixed together. So it's like, it has a marbled appearance. And if you've ever had it, you know, it's really good and really soft, but I don't know how well it's gonna, you know, translate to a potato chip, but let's find out. Okay, so let's smell it. it smells weird. It doesn't really smell like steak or beef. A little bit worried. Also, I probably should mention I found these in the discount section of the supermarket, so <laughs> I'm a little bit more worried, but let's hope they taste good. So they have this strange shape. I don't know why they did this. This looks like a, a weird ruffle. I don't know. It might be too bright for you to see it. Hopefully, if I move it back here, you can see it. I don't know, but it has some kind of like brown stuff on it, which I'm guessing is the flavor, but Let's taste it and let's see how it tastes. I don't know what that was supposed to be. It, it tastes like, uh, you had those like small bugle corn chips. It's like that. I thought this was a more of a potato chip, but this is actually a corn chip. And it tastes like one of those bugles with something else on it. Um, I don't even know how to describe this. Yeah, it tastes like, like two or three different like, <laughs> corn chips put together it almost tastes like a like frito with like a bugle with like something else on it it's not that terrible but when they hyped me up for some beef i expected that and it really doesn't taste like that it has like some like saltiness to it i'm guessing it has like a little bit of like a savory taste to it too but it's not really anything like beef so i don't know i guess this is made by frito lays i'm guessing this was like some japanese special edition or something but yeah I don't know. Good marketing. So on the bag, it looks really good. Like, oh, wow, this is, you know, uh, Kobe beef or something. But eh, I don't know if it's quite that quality. It's not terrible. And I don't know if it's bad enough that it needed to be in the discount section. I mean, I might buy this again. I might snack on this. But as far as it being like some high quality beef flavor or something, eh, it doesn't really taste like that. It just tastes like a corn chip with a bit of salt and maybe something else, some other kind of seasoning on it. But Overall, it's not bad, but I can't give it, you know, four stars. I can't give it an A or something like that. But it's definitely not an F. You know, it needs some stars because it doesn't taste bad. But you just, you let me down. But I don't know. What can you expect? I guess you can't expect uh, Kobe beef for, you know, like $2. But try it yourself. Tell me what you think about this. And hopefully I have some more videos with me testing stuff uh, soon. and. Maybe if I'm not under quarantine, I'll go out and look at some cherry blossoms and try to get some videos like that out for you soon. But until then, see you.